and didn't like get yeeted. Hi everyone. So I have completely restarted my PC and as you can uh, see by the new stream title, uh, yeah, we're giving up all Fallout 4. Um, I don't, I don't want to spend too much time since we already spent a long time talking during stream. I don't want to spend uh, too much time uh, trying to mess with Fallout 4. If it's not going to run, it's not going to run. Um, so our best shot is to play the game that is pretty damn reliable, which would be uh, ERBS or Eternal Return. In fact, let's announce that on Twitter real quick. I'm good, I'm good. <laughs> no, this isn't stressing me out too much. I had a backup in place because it was supposed to be yesterday straight. Um... So we'll just move to that. I am just writing. Yeah, Bethesda game broke my PC. <laughs> I'm just sad for the double ping <laughs> in the the fact I'm probably going to have to edit this stream too. This should be fun. <laughs> okay, let's get ERBS open and head over here. Come on, Bubby. There we go. Yeah, yeah. Luckily, I already uh, kind of planned for if Fallout decided to bug. Mostly because it was doing it so much during the subathon. I kind of attributed it at the time to, well, my PC has been running for 12 hours. But like, it, it was, I don't know if it's just the Xbox version or what, but like, it's buggy. <laughs> there was like a Brahmin on somebody's head. There was like a black screen here. Oh, there we go. Okay. Okay. We are good, but there is no audio because I turned it down. So let's turn that back up to about there. There we go. Oh, that's a cute skin for heart. Unfortunately, I'll never play her. <laughs> All right, let's get some practice in with uh, my main. Yeah, Fallout, Fallout 4 was just completely bugged out. There was some parts where I swear I was like touching the chest of an NPC with a shotgun and it would miss. <laughs> and I'm like, my stats aren't that low in that category. He shouldn't be, you know, missing that much. I can only imagine that it's an Xbox version. I never had that many problems with the Steam version and I played since day one. It might be an Xbox Live issues because the Xbox Live integration sometimes messes with games in uh, unintended fashions. So I'm going to turn that down a bit because in my mix, it's a bit loud. But of course, my mix is a bit louder than your guys' so let's see what that looks like. Ah, that's fine. It's background noise. I'm going to wake up Cerise at 4 a.m. for this. Oh, my goodness. No, no, don't wake up Cerise. The cutie needs her beauty rest. Where is my enemy? She, she needs her time for sleep. I, I try not to bug her. Like, I, I won't send anything to her DMs until I know she's awake because I'm like... I would be really angry if, like, someone sent me a DM while I was asleep and it woke me up, so I'm not going to do that to her. The thing is, though, I am an extremely heavy sleeper, <laughs> so that's not normally a problem I face, but I'm like, well, if I'm empathetic, like, that would be an issue if I wasn't. But uh, I 
oh, they've upgraded this a bit since the last time we were here. There's actually tips. That is awesome. Oh, wait, you can press Alt to find Glut. When the hell has that been a feature? That must... Wow. Yeah, it's not only she loves to get DMs anytime. Like, I, I'm... <sighs> I'm afraid I'll start getting into a conversation and then she'll be like, oh, yeah, at 6 a.m. You woke me up and then I'll feel like crap. She always sleeps like a stone. Sometimes I've I've caught her once or twice being like, well, I got woken up by something. But like most of the time, she's pretty solid sleeper, but I'm the kind where I basically pass out for eight hours and I don't remember what happened. I have slept through natural disasters. <laughs> I, I have slept through earthquakes for context. Um, anyone who lives in California can probably tell you it's pretty hard to sleep through a 5.0 earthquake. I have done it. <laughs> but it's, it's mainly just like the best way I can describe it is I sleep to the point where it's basically as if I had anesthesia. Sally went from Kansas and Oz. No, back when I used to sleepwalk, there's a image that Master has. I don't know when it was taken. Because, of course, fun with memory. Um, I don't remember the context for this. But there's a photo of me on this, like, speaker set that they had for the television. Uh, like sleepwalking, and I fell asleep there. So I have had times where I've woken up in places that weren't on my bed, but luckily I don't do that much anymore, if at all. Excuse me. Excuse me. Really? Do you want to leave me alone, or do you want to keep being an ass? Okay, you know what? Okay. Damn it. What was, was right this? <sighs> it's kind of funny that she evolved like a trust issue for me not sleeping when I sleep. True. Why was he gunning for me that early? What? Thought? It, it's, it's like that meme whenever someone tries to like kill me that early into a match where it's like, I sometimes wonder what's going on inside their head. <laughs> Where I'm just like under the thought of like, what, what you think in there, buddy? Oh, is Barbara out out yet or? Oh, no, Barbara's out. Okay. Hmm. Get memed on. Yeah, pretty much. Hmm, do I want to save up and eventually earn Barber? No, I can't spend money right now. I can't spend money right now. I need to save. At least until tomorrow, probably. <sighs> ba ba. Ba 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 ba. Oh, dang it. I'm missing out on drip drops. <laughs> yeah, I got memed on hard. But, um... What I was kind of saying, like... I, I don't really sleepwalk m anymore. I'll mainly wake up in the same position I passed out in. It wasn't rage quit fallout. It's more... I already talked for 40 minutes, which, believe me, if you've been here before for my just chatting segments, 40 minutes is a while <laughs> for that just chatting segment. Usually I'm done before the 10 minute mark. MGP, I'm not even shocked anymore. I used to be like, oh my God, go to sleep. And now it's like, oh, MGP is just being MGP with his no sleep. <laughs> Yeah, it was more, I spent 40 minutes talking and then trying to get the game to work, and I didn't want to waste too much time trying to get the game to work. So I just went for a game I knew would start. 
I started no sleep. Yeah, I uh, you did. And I reamed you for it. <laughs> that was like the most confident I was in the very early scrub group is basically me yelling at you to sleep. You do it too, Blue. I know there, there, there just needs to be a bunk for whenever you come on screen. Yeah, just just a bonk that happens where it's just like this. You just yelled at me often. No, it wasn't even yelling at you often. It was more you need to go to sleep. What the hell are you doing? Or what universe did you think that it was OK? Yeah, good old Jackbox days. Also, Minecraft, you yelled at me more than I yelled at you. That was a fun stream, though. Yeah. No, I don't think it was a good reason. I think Bob Champ is a wonderful nickname, Shep. That everyone should know and spam at you. <laughs> you will never escape it. <laughs> I will not allow it. <laughs> Where is my Bob Champ, Bob Champ, Bob Champ. <laughs> I won't, and I know this, yep. Also, I still think one of the top clips that I ever had was you screaming at me and Shep. Uh, no, it was me and Scrub. <laughs> it was screaming at me and Scrub because you said VTubers, and I was like... Wait, is he doing that as a meme or is he just like, or, or is he being serious? So I kind of asked out of curiosity and you're like, that's just how I speak. Are you making fun of my accent? And in a moment of unplanned brilliance, we just both went, yeah. <laughs> and you, you tirade kills me to this day though. Fuck you both. <laughs> I was dying laughing. <laughs> It's my accent. I know now. I know now. <laughs> okay. To be fair, I don't know an Aussie accent, so it's just basically British with spice for me trying Aussie accents because I haven't nailed it yet and I have no confidence. Uncultured? Yeah, sh no shit. I'm American. That just happens with the fucking... <laughs> The instant you're born here, it's like, hi, you will only learn about this country until you possibly go to college. And then you'll realize other countries other than the U.S. and Europe existed and probably played a giant role. You were born there? <laughs> F. <laughs> Glad you escaped, homie. No, I'm kidding. I actually I I. I don't mind a lot about the U.S. I don't want to get too political and talk about like beliefs and all that crap uh but like there are points of improvement i would love to see but otherwise i like living here plane almost crashed yeah oh i've had that happen before uh we were going on a trip to meet with master's family and i couldn't back out of it so we went to like the midwest and we experienced really heavy turbulence. I'm talking plane dropped and it was it was like a roller coaster when you hit that like airtime section. I just came out of my seat and I'm just like, well, goodbye. <laughs> Here is where I die. I will be acknowledged. Looks like people used to visit the island too. You can you can back out of it just open the emergency door on the plane. No, there there was no backing out of it. It was basically, well, this is my fate. <laughs> I surely can use these branches for something. You want to continue that, homie, or do you just want to get that one hit for the EXP? Because I'll allow the one hit. I will not let you sit here and stab me multiple times. Oh, that's good at least.
Um, I need a knife and just a knife now. Oh, wow, that is a huge improvement, actually, where they, uh, like, de-highlight things you've already gotten. Okay, can you fuck right off? What? Why? What is... What is with, like, these games we've been playing today? Like, everyone is gunning for me. This won't be rubbish, right? Okay, there's my knife. Cool. We need one more thing of branches. Insufficient inventory space, of course. I think I can use this. Yeah, I don't know what it has been, but everyone has come for my head. I surely can use these branches for something. I just don't play these type of games. That's a real way to win. To uh, too. No, then you're just a beta. I can't do that because not everyone gets that reference. <laughs> God damn it. Why do I have to know just niche memes that nobody else will get? If only they could give us drama memes. <laughs> Are there questions, Bob? <laughs> You've already heard me reference another video of theirs, Blue. This should not be a shock to you. A survivor has been eliminated. F. I think I can use this. But like a good example is there's a uh, group of YouTubers called uh, Red Letter Media or RLM. And I absolutely love them. I love them to bits. They are absolutely hysterical. Uh, they're one of my favorite channels on YouTube. And one of the few where I'm like, the instant there is a new upload, I want to be there to watch it. Because I will probably be dying laughing. Um, they're one of the few. But it's things where if you haven't seen the shit they've watched... The things I find absolutely hysterical will make no sense to you. Uh, because it's from either like really obscure shit from the 90s or things that like 99% of the general public hasn't seen before RLM. No one will ever be a Sigma male here. Hell yeah. Okay. Really, I, I can't find these two items that I need. Oh my god, this is going to be killer. Okay, finally we have the flower. Is it uh, like, I could say something like... Uh, okay, what's a reference I can probably actually do on Twitch? Because I thought of one, but then I remembered, oh yeah, that's probably not Twitch appropriate because they won't understand the context. And I could explain it all I please. It won't do anything. Finally, we find a fucking hammer. Okay, that was full cap. They had nothing. Okay, Avenue's closing in a minute or two. I don't want to anger Twitch Coon. Uh, if I'm... Okay, one reference I could probably do, because it's so ambiguous that I don't think Twitch can get angry at it is um the sound uh, is it will just drive me into comedic laughter because of the thing that's behind it but of course if you haven't seen either the terrible movie that they're referencing or no no i didn't although i think the person who made the movie i'm referencing maybe did <laughs> Up, oh, shite, 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 Check here real quick. Oh, wait, it has a thing I need. Oh, god damn it. No, no, no. Water, get out. Leg, get in. Panic, 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 panic. One. We are gamers. Look at us go. No, no, no. That wasn't a stroke. Uh, for slight context, there is a movie called Suburban Sasquatch. Gamers win the game you did not. Hey, I'm, I've done better than three people so far. And I've also won this multiple times. Um, to kind of give reference to that stupid sound I just made. Uh, 
Uh, there, there is a uh, movie called Suburban Sasquatch, where <laughs> the the per the thing is, there is a behind the scenes where this guy talks about this film as if it's like some art film. This like. Steven Spielberg s expression of the human condition and it's just the worst movie you've ever seen but he he talks about it like as if it's a movie because <laughs> because he knows how people who make movies talk I came out the it came out the year I was born huh uh, yeah it it looks like it <laughs> uh if you guys want to look away into another tab real quick and look up the cover. Uh, it, it should tell you everything you need to know about the quality of the film. And while we're doing that, we can talk about the creator who's talking about this like, you know, I talked to my prop director and my uh, director of cinematography and we planned out this scene so that there would be like the maximum exposure on these actors. He's, he talks the way that people who write movies should probably talk. The problem is his movie looks like absolute garbo. Uh, his movie looks like absolute trash. But he knows how people who make movies talk. So he talks like the people who make movies talk. So it's just the funniest mixture of this guy taking himself like super seriously. <laughs> and like the crappy thing he has made. A new area has been restricted. And it's just the like break between those two that just kills me. <laughs> it came up with Jar Jar Binks when I looked it up. Uh yeah, they also what RLM is the most famous for is they did a retrospect of the entire Star Wars series. Which is amazing to me because they actually did a really good job of even like making fun of the Star Wars films, which is a hard task with the fan base and have them accept it. Okay, so alas, poor Yorick. Sally, yes. Fear. How dare you not have mithril? Oh, there's somebody here. There's somebody here. There's somebody here. I need to eat brib. Hold on, you have no meat. There we go, baby. That's our first kill. Okay, healing potion. That's useful. Uh... Honey, I will take that so we can make some honey. Actually, no, let's make garlic bread. Garlic bread is probably going to be a better use of my resources. Uh, can we hide out somewhere over here and heal? Nice. Okay, so we're down to top 10 at least. What the fuck am I looking at? I see a movie. Yeah, it's, it's, a, it's a movie? Question mark? <laughs> I don't want to see the movie. Oh, no. Uh, Shep, you want to see the movie, but not for the reasons you'd want to see a movie. H here's the way I'll explain it. You want to see it in the way you want to see a car crash. You don't actually want to see the car crash. You want to see a destruction of like the car itself. You wouldn't actually like go watch a car crash and be like, oh yeah, this bad thing. No, you would be like, oh my God, I hope everyone's okay. But damn that thing, like breaking apart looked cool. So watching the room, exactly. It's watching the room. You don't watch the room because you want to watch a movie. You watch the room <laughs> because you want to laugh your ass off at a train wreck. <laughs> and the delusions of the man who made the train wreck. Someone is consecutively eliminating survivors. 
I would like to rest a bit. Yeah, you're not actually watching the room for a good quality film. You're watching the room to laugh your ass off. Is the best way I can probably explain that. It's it's the same for Honestly, if I can find the film on YouTube, I will watch it. Um I honestly one of the ones I recently watched and I wanted I, I have an idea for movie night, but I don't want to do the same cliche like we're going to watch Ghibli because <laughs> like everyone does that. And eventually there's so many times you can watch Ghibli before you're just like, OK, I don't want to see Ghibli anymore. I, I want to do bad movie nights where we just watch terrible films. I uh, that that's what I really want to do. Okay, hold on. Where is Mithril going to be? Mithril probably is going to be the easiest get. So all of these are going. So maybe mm -hmm. go back to Uptown for now, and then head up to Temple. Yeah. The films I really, really want to do are like films that are knowingly terrible. Like, I want to do Samurai Cop, which is a film I've seen quite recently. Or like a film that you might be a bit more familiar with in uh, Cats 2019. <laughs> because uh, to show you how much I love terrible movies, I own Cats 2019 on Blu-ray. <laughs> I bought it. <laughs> I spent money on it. Okay, let's head up to Temple. Sally, we can't be friends anymore? No, I hate that movie. <laughs> this is a problem? No, this is a wonderful fucking thing. Because I have literally taken friends to go watch this movie for the sheer purpose of I can't believe what I've just seen. So I need someone else to verify it for me. I only want to watch the cap up version. Oh, my God. The cap -up version. I, I was one of the people you probably won't find the tweets anymore because I completely nuked that account. But I was one of the people when like hashtag cap up version was going around. I, I fucking I joined in. I'm just like, yes. This is what I want to see. Give me the cat butt for shit. And not for like, I actually want to see that or I'd have any interest in it. It's just, I want to, to see this film worse. I, okay, Shep, if I explain the reason for me buying the DVD, will you possibly be a bit more forgiving towards it? Because I actually don't have a bad reason for buying it. My reason for buying it is I wanted I the special, it. like, credits. Please tell me you have Mithril. Okay, please tell me you have Mithril. None of you have Mithril. Wonderful. Okay, I know where the bears usually spawn. They usually spawn, nope, not there. They usually spawn over here. And there are bears. You have Moonstone. You disappoint me. Okay, let's eat stir-fried ramen. Get some health back. I bought it so I could watch the special, like... The director's commentary is a good way to put it. That is the reason I bought Cats. It's because I wanted to hear people seriously talk about this film. And laugh at them. <laughs> I was left with no oh my god, nobody. Nothing. I should hurry and go back. Hold on, where are we getting restricted to? I probably am gonna be the safest at Alley. Quiet and calm atmosphere surrounds this place. The clan has been set to temple. Yeah, bullying directors, I can respect that. Yeah, that's the literal only reason I bought it is I wanted to hear people talk seriously about the film and then I wanted to laugh at them. And there goes my Twitch partnership. Uh, dude, we'd have to work a long time to get Twitch partnership. I am... 
I am nowhere close to that even being a feasible goal. Okay, temple seems pretty done with. And it's not even bullying directors. It's more... Just become a TikToker. I, I've thought about doing TikTok, but I'd have to get my model, like, rigged before that's a reasonable thought. You better fu- ah! Okay, I need to rest or I'm going to die. Resting now will combat some of this <sighs> we need to finally get Q going. Stonks? Yeah, it is, honestly, if you're talking about, like, best new promotion tactic, TikTok's that. Um, no, I'm not even gonna do IRL. I'll do stuff in, like, VTube Studio. That's not an issue for me. But just... My biggest thing... A new area has been restricted. Okay, so we're all going to archery range, then. Interesting. Me wear mask, me make funny. Okay, so we're down to top three. And it's not as if I have like zero kills, so this won't be a death sentence. But I do need to fight this bear. Oh my god, no bear has mithril. Oh, Jesus Christ. Okay. I need Mithro for my build to be completed. Okay. It's only two people. I'm not going to mess with you. Yep. They're going to isolate us down here. So let's head to archery range. And uh, hope either she comes to me or I come to her. We can cheese this. Nope, she's not in here. Okay, let's activate console, which will tell her I'm here. And then... Kill Bat to get some EXP. I still have some food, so there is healing. It, it kind of does feel like you're signing a contract. Okay, let's make as much noise to let her know where I'm at. She wants to kill me. She's going to have to come get me. It's okay, Blue Zero. Rubbish, right? Get some sleep as well. And six, five, four. Let's just do the. Oh. Oh. Maybe I should pick up archery. Hey, Bubby. <laughs> Who am I trying to? Hey, play? Bubby. Fuck! No! I was so close! See you, MGP! Ah! Oh, that was so close to a W, boys. You saw how low the health bar was. Ah! Uh, and I am... Oh my god, I'm so close to getting that one as well. No! Honestly, I think if I would have killed her, I actually would have gotten both of my daily quests done now. Uh, gamer. I'm gamer. So I game. Ah, my neck is crunchy. Yeah, what other bad fil- Oh. <laughs> You, most people will probably not recognize this name. I am, I am planning on buying every, uh, Neil Breed film. Where is my enemy? Uh, Neil Breen is a director who basically, uh, take Tommy Wiseau and add delusions of grandeur to, like, a thousand. And then throw in some belief of God powers for, uh, some spice. Where's the gamer rage? There's no rage on that one. That was just bad luck. He looks like a crack addict. He probably is. <laughs> he probably is. 
that that dude does not look like the kind of person who's like i've never done drugs no that that man has 100 percent done drugs but yeah uh he he has directed four films i think five now but one of them basically talks about the production process of the other four and all of them have some like oddity to them where it's just like it's super strange <laughs> and i want to watch all of them front to back because i've heard other people talk about them and talk about the plot i've not actually heard other people <laughs> like you know I, i've not seen the full thing so i want to experience all of it for myself <laughs> Because from descriptions I've heard from others, this man sounds insane. You fool, I am. <laughs> I, I'm the kind of person when I hear a movie is terrible, I want to go figure out why. This is how your psyche breaks, as if mine hasn't already. <laughs> when, when I hear something is bad, I'm the kind of person who's like, I want to figure out why for myself. So like, good example. Sonic 06 comes out. Pretty much universally hated. Especially the PS3 version, which I couldn't get, unfortunately. But I could get the Xbox version. So I bought it. <laughs> it was like bargain basement dirt cheap when I bought it. I'm talking like you probably couldn't find it for under like... You, you couldn't find it for over like twenty dollars so me being broke gamer is like oh this is bad and it's sonic which i loved sonic at the time i the the, the series hasn't given me much to like in the recent years But yeah, I, I bought Sonic 06 and I played through it. Check this carefully. You guys enjoy yourself. No, no, no. You guys enjoy yourself. I'm going to go over here. We can get through this trauma together. The hotel is cleaner and bigger than expected. Yeah, it, it was a trip, man. That, that game... Um, excuse me, ma'am. But the thing is, I found that, like, jokes and memes aside, the game wasn't as bad as people were, like, panning it out to be. People were acting like this was the fucking next E.T. for the Atari, where it was, like, going to kill the Sonic franchise. And it didn't end up like that it wasn't as bad as people kept claiming it to be are you sure i couldn't get through the first level no that wasn't the problem for me i'm the kind of person where like even if something is challenging i'll keep trying it i'll try different tactics i'll try different techniques and yes it was cringy yes i died at the voice acting Yes, there were multiple parts where I wondered the decision making of the director or the direction of like the script writing. But other than that, like, I, I don't know if it was my copy or whatever, but it wasn't as broken and uh, broken and buggy as people were saying that Sonic 06 was. Is there just no knife? OK, there we go. We have ah, uh, I have to build something and then we can take the knife. Is it? done? I would like to rest. A there we go. Yeah, my, my copy was not as broken and glitchy as people were saying. Although that one lava level and the one ball level can go screw themselves. I ended up cheating <laughs> for the ball level. Uh, basically, there's like a speed run tactic where you uh, use the levitate to basically glitch out of the level and then solve it that way. That's what I eventually ended up doing because I'm ch oh, it's no use. It's no use. Or in the words of like Game Grumps, it's no use. It's no fucking use. 
Is it done? The survivor has been eliminated. I'm not going to try and get the mithril this early, and as long as I don't attack the bears, they'll just let me pass through them. Okay, I need hammer. Are we going to have a repeat of the last situation where, like, I look for a hammer for 20 minutes? Or for, like, five minutes into a match? I'm not going to over-exaggerate. I'm glad they canonically killed Silver the Hedgehog with a 9 mil to the brain. <laughs> they pretty much did. Uh, has Silver really appeared in a game since then has been eliminated. already well have fun with that um i'm gonna keep working on my build here generations that's it yeah but that was basically like we're gonna celebrate the whole sonic franchise even the parts you hate <laughs> so prepare yourself yeah i won't say sonic 06 was a good game it wasn't but i will say it's not as bad as people who like rag on it keep talking about i stopped playing after generations same <laughs> i will say this same properly, right? this, i'm just sense. looking over at my discord right now because it's stuck on my tweets because i can't really change it and keep the game up and i'm seeing the like thumbnail i spent effort on last night for us for us playing fallout and it just makes me angry the fallout didn't work Will it contain something useful? Only traces of civilization remain. Actually, no, I can kill this poor now. A survivor has been eliminated. Why are these boars so tanky? What? I got generations on Steam for one dollar, so it's pog. I got it on. I believe I got the 3DS version. Okay, so people are pretty far away from me at this point, but if we're at the same level, I outpower them. And let's make sure of that. It turned out incredible. This won't be rubbish, right? I got the 3DS version and then I got the Xbox version. Nice. Shep finally joining the TikTok. Help me, there is no help for you. Only traces of civilization remain. You have joined the cult. You there is no salvation here. There is only pain. Oh my god, please tell me you left the leather on the wild dog. You did! Yo! Oh, I need SP badly, so we're gonna take a nap. I should be editing highlights currently, but I'd be lazy right now. Dude, editing takes so much effort. Like, way more than it should. For me, at least, because I'm still learning editing. So, for me, going through the process of editing and doing all of that stuff, like, it's a lot. Hold on, I just realized something happened and I might have to change that. Uh, it took me half an hour for my channel trailer. Here's how uh, lazy I've gotten. I haven't even filmed one yet. Uh, I could probably in like half an hour do the voiceover portion and then basically just put it over my model going in wacky directions. It's not a hard thing to do. It's just like, it wouldn't even be filming mainly. It'd just be uh, going into Photoshop uh, and making like five or six images of ways I want my model to move. Because my model is not rigged yet. Uh, still waiting on a few things for that. But I am being very patient as I didn't even plan to debut until like July. Just watch mine and do that. It's easier. Probably, but it's... The thing is, I, when I get a creative brain, when I get, like, those moments in my head... Oh, you son of a bitch. When I get those moments in my head where I'm like, I, I want to do the creative today, 
Like my brain won't like settle for just like, oh, I'm gonna half-ass this. When I get into creative brain, it's like, no, 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 we're going to do this to the best quality and you're going to, you're going to actually spend effort on this or I'm whooping your ass. <laughs> And it's why there's so many times where I'll talk about like a, doing a project or something and there will be the phrase, this took me a lot of work. I hope you guys enjoy it. It's because usually I'm like tired out of my mind by the time it's released because I've been working for like six or seven hours on it. Okay, let's get out of alley is Forest okay. Forest is okay. I'm just doing this for fun. Boom, baby! Let's do that for fun. Okay. SP regen, good. Uh, purified water. Ooh. Ooh, that's actually really damn good regen. Hold up. Oh, hardcore Minecraft is fun. I I hope you have fun going down that rabbit hole. I don't know much about it cuz I haven't really been exploring too much, but like it looks fun. I already died once. F. For me, the most like hardcore Minecraft I did was playing Arbelcraft. <laughs> I love how they are. This is not a place to be when I land in school. I fucking I can't believe we all just agreed with each other like we're gonna bully this poor Yori player. <laughs> And then we're gonna go off on our separate ways and not hurt each other. I love that shit. Oh my god, that fucking killed me. I'm sorry. I'm not choking, I'm laughing. I promise you, I'm just laughing. Okay, I need mithril badly. Can I get that from forest? Yes, maybe from the wolves. But really where I want to head to is... Uh, Dock. Oh, but... Yeah, uh, you you missed out on us bullying a poor, poor uh, Yuri player. We we bullied a poor Yuri player, and then just went on our separate ways because we're evil. I love how there was no communication. There was no like, hey, you want to bully this man? There was just three people on that one guy just bullying the shit out of him. <laughs> and then we left. Yeah, thank you, Shep, for the clip. <laughs> that poor gentleman, he just wanted to have a good time. And, uh... Hey, Bobby. Hey, I'm going to go this way. Uh, hope you don't mind. Hope you don't mind. I'm gonna go this way. You mind. No. We have to do this fight. Damn it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, really did. We just, I, I came in like at the very end and I'm like, you know what, fun, let's join in. Fight back, fight back. Yeah, pretty much, that was the that was the epitome of fight back. Hold on, I need to do one thing real quick. Uh, this has a bit to do with, uh, yes, like yesterday shenanigans. There we go. So let's head here and go back to the game. You know, ninth place isn't bad. Ninth place is not bad. Yeah, that was really a fight back moment. <laughs> I I just bullied that poor man's. <laughs> uh, 
Uh, so, uh, yeah, that I had to do something real quick that was associated with the fun yesterday because I didn't know if it was catching on stream or not because uh, I was doing window capture. <clears throat> but uh, in a last ditch effort to hopefully sleep on the time I left the PC on to try and render the Omori video, which still is not uploaded because I gave up on it. Um, yeah, I, I turned the nightlight on hoping like if I just block out as much of the blue light as I can, maybe I can sleep. That's not how it worked. <laughs> that's, that's not how it worked. I still had a terrible night's rest. It was bad. It was so bad. But yeah, I didn't know if it was catching on stream or not. So I'm just like, well, preemptively, let's just get rid of that. <laughs> yeah. And honestly, I wanted to stream DMs, by the way. I could check it real quick while I'm waiting for a match. <laughs> you know what? I was Shep. No cap, like, no lie. I was half tempted to make that my profile picture. Because <laughs> if you've been around Twitter today, like, I have seen so many people. Oh, dude. Yo, buddy. Welcome to the stream. Welcome, welcome. That's what you get. I'm tempted. I'm honestly tempted to change my PFP to that. Because uh, there were just so many gorillas on my profile today, and I don't know why. Like, there's no explanation. So I just wanted to put, like, Suburban Sasquatch there and just constantly uh, type all of my tweets today as... <laughs> with no context given as to why I am doing this. <laughs> But uh, I kind of gave up on that idea because I'm like, well, shit, I'm streaming today and I'm kind of kicking myself because I'm not streaming tomorrow. I had a joke planned in everything. <laughs> I already had my meme tweet of the day with uh, the when the garlic bread or whatever the hell I posted when I was like sleep deprived <laughs> whatever the hell I posted when I was sleep deprived uh that thing <laughs> I, I'm tempted to still do it I don't know actually were you curb stomped prior? no um <laughs> No, what happened is I was just tired and like Artemis tweeted something of the same vein. So I was just like, hee hee, send the funny. <laughs> I didn't, there, there was no thought process behind it. There was no like, oh, I'm totally doing this as like a joke that I want people to respond to. I did it because I was tired and it was funny. <laughs> Okay, now now the more I'm looking at Suburban Sasquatch, the more it is tempting to do that. Hmm. The fucking cat. <laughs> oh, the like the, the cat image you sent. By the way, on that topic, like, do you like it when your garlic bread is basically a loaf cut in half covered in garlic? Or do you like the little like individual slices because I like basically having a small loaf of bread as garlic bread that is my crack that is my favorite uh, this is pretty much similar to the other plan except I don't have to beg on mithril this might actually be useful charcoal black hell yeah oh my god there was this barbecue place that was close by to like the mansion I think it's unfortunately shut down due to uh, current events. But uh, what they would do is they would do uh, smoked garlic bread. Where basically they would throw this garlic butter covered bread 
in with the meats they were smoking. So it got that like Sometimes applewood flavor that the meats were smoking in. And let me tell you, no Italian place can compare to how fucking amazing that garlic bread was. I would, I would like sneakily ask the waitress, like, can you just give me a container full of the garlic bread? And she'd be like, yeah, of course, sure. And then I would take it home, cover it in mozzarella and make my like wonderful cheesy garlic bread with the like smoke still on there. It was incredible. Oh, wait, my build's complete. Okay, I just need stick or hoping that one of these Yo, let's go. Let's go. I, I, I imagine Shep's not typing because he's just thinking about it. This should work properly, right? I surely can use these branches for something. But yeah, I, I still think that's one of the best garlic breads I've had. I was looking at Twitter. What do you want? I was talking about garlic bread. You want more cat pics? No, I'm more than good on that 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 cat. And oh my god. Uh, be check out on. I have to. There we go. Oh no. What was that? The like. There was an internet joke a while back where it's like, you have subscribed to Cat Facts. Oh, thank you for the hydrate redeem. Good at this. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> it was like, you have been subscribed to Cat Facts. Please text this to, you know, cancel. And the person would just give random facts about cats. My man, I go to sleep for a while. I'm right back. It's an addiction, man. Is it done? Oh god, I have two minutes in Av. Ugh. Well, speed run. Please tell me that uh Okay, Allie is fine. I just need to get through Av quickly. Let's hope there's not a lot to far. Okay, let's hope for luck. That's not a good start. This is not a good start. I'm probably going to have to get 90% of my stuff from other areas. Cat fact, there are no cats. Cats do not exist. Okay, so we're at the two minute mark. I need to build something. This is a copper item. Oh no, what I was thinking of is when you said that was just that a uh, cat is not real. A uh, cat cannot hurt you, cat. <laughs> Darkfire, hello. Welcome to the stream. No bat. This won't be rubbish. Um, I need slippers, slippers, slippers. Okay, uh, let's make no. Let's make you. You are probably the quickest thing I can make. Get the slippers and we're done. I'm doing wonderful, Darkfire. How about yourself? How are you doing? Actually, no. I have time to kill chickens. Good to hear, good to hear. It's been a it's been a bit, but I'm glad to see you. I am really glad to see you here. Survivor has been eliminated. Not Sacagawea. <laughs> oh my god though. Oh my god, are we gonna get our build before we get our ult? Oh my god, this is new. Now, now I can this is basically all the benefits of that old Mithril build, but like a lot of the good stuff from it as well. I'm pretty good at this. Okay, I need to collect a few more things here to complete my build and just kill a chicken for kicks. Also, my local KFC is now doing donuts. What does the world come to? 
Um, so you guys, yeah, there's just so many times where fast food companies will just unleash the weirdest shit onto the market and it confuses the hell out of me. Like when McDonald's put out the spicy chicken sandwich recently. Like, you are not going to compete with Popeyes or, um... Another question. It would be nice to find a safe route ahead of time. Okay, search complete. That means I'm done with my build. Yeah, you're not going to compete with, uh... Chick-fil-A or Popeyes in that game. Why are you trying? <laughs> What the fuck is a McRiddle? Um, Americans thinking you know what sounds good. That is literally the definition of what a McGriddle is. It is an American going, you know what sounds good? I want to eat sausage. I also want to eat pancakes, but I want to do it in my car. How can we make this happen? Damn it! Ugh. It was a perfect loss. Damn it! I was so close to that kill. Ugh. I have seen the face of God, and He hasn't abandoned us. No, no, He hasn't. I've actually never had a McGriddle. I just don't. I I don't find the idea of it appetizing. So it just, I have no want <laughs> to do it. I'll, if I'm getting breakfast at McDonald's, I'm going like sausage McMuffin because I know it's going to taste decent. <laughs> Shep, get that curse out my chat. Shep, get that curse out my chat. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to get something that I know will not be mediocre, but will at least be edible. You're talking about inflation in my chat. Get that curse out of here. <laughs> I went on DeviantArt once and it was pain. Gore, welcome! Welcome, welcome. No, 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 no. <laughs> Are you going? Everyone's welcoming Gore, and Shep realizes what he's done. <laughs> Shep, you caused this. Stop, 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 stop. <laughs> You're the one who put that implication into my chat, Shep. Are you just type? Are you spamming no just to get it out of my like stream window? <laughs> is that what you're doing? It is him saying help. That is his way of saying help me. <laughs> stop! You wasted 400 points to tell me to stop. <laughs> Shep, what have you done? <laughs> yes. He, he has brought out the implications of um, some terrible nightmares. I'll fucking do it again. <laughs> what curse have you brought upon us? Oh boy, I still see it. It's still there. You know what? I've, he I've been hearing Bernice got nerfed. I want to see what they mean. Let let's try Bernice real quick. Is Bernice still like casual, like optimized? I'll fucking do it again. <laughs> oh my god. The... Oh my god. Sh Shep has brought a great curse upon our chat. I need to apologize. Yes. 
Yes, you do. It's okay, I forgive you. No, no, Shep, get the twit longer ready. I'm making a fucking call-out post as soon as the stream's over. <laughs> Discord, let me apologize. <laughs> what have you done? <laughs> what have you done? Look, hold on, it hasn't come through to me yet. All I see is the cat and it's saying me whenever you mention Bob Champ. No, in your server, I can't I can't go over there right now. Let me apologize formally. <laughs> I can't I can't go over there to uh, either drag you in or uh, move to general. You're going to have to type it to me. <laughs> I'm joking, by the way, Shep, you're fine. <laughs> I will sit here to apologize. Oh, you're going to atone for your sins by just sitting. <laughs> okay, let's do... This one worked well for me last time because it's nice and consolidated. Who read it? Effing script. Hi, Satina! Even if you're just dropping by, hello and welcome to the stream! Okay, so we gotta go uptown, factory, chapel, dock. Or, no, I should go full sherry the Satina, hey! <laughs> The experiment will now begin. Nice voice. Yeah, honestly, the thing, the thing I love the most about like popping into uh, Cerise's streams when I can, is is her mic peaking when she says my name because I know for a fact she's probably yelling it because she's excited to see me. Because especially with work now, I've been a lot more busy. So I have less time to just be lurking in DMs. Internet not really great here. It's fine. I understand completely. Every I, I I've said this before, but like last weekend I went to go get my COVID shot. My like first shot out of two. And uh, I told Cerise, like, I'm going to try and stay in your stream so I have, like, so I basically can, like, calm down by watching your streams. Because, uh, fun fact about Sally, I fucking hate needles. <laughs> I am terrified Easy to track. of getting shots. So I'm like panicking that I have to go get this shot. But at the same time, I'm like telling myself, you know, you need to go do this. It's really important because getting this done with this be means I can possibly go see my friends again soon. And I really am missing my friends. Also, I have new friends that I want to meet. And for that, I need to be immunized. Are you done? Okay, goodbye. You're an ass. <laughs> Next time, I'll set up so I'm trying to watch, like, her stream. And also, I sent her, like, a donation for, uh, reasons. But, like, good reasons, wholesome reasons. Um, but basically, I'm trying to watch her stream, and I had just sent the donation, and all I hear is, ah, sa, di, but, that. <laughs> and I'm like, ah, crap. Because I was up in, like, a region where the internet isn't very nice. To me especially for like data so basically i got every like third or fourth word she was saying occasionally 
<laughs> so yeah, I can I can relate, Satina. I can relate to that so hard. But yeah, COVID shot actually. Can I talk about that? I don't think it breaks to us. I haven't seen anything about people being like, oh, I talked about COVID and now my channel's banned. So I got the shot. The day of, I felt completely fine until I went to go to bed and then my right arm hurt a little bit. And then basically it hurt for the next three days. And then I was fine. But it didn't hurt to a level where like it inconvenienced me. It hurt to a level where like if I bumped into something, I would have a bad time. Or if I put my elbow down somewhere, I had a bad time. So during the subathon, it really didn't affect me too much. When it really hit me is when I had to go into my kitchen and cook stuff. Because I would bump into cabinets or I would bump or I would put my elbow on the counter to like stabilize something. And every time my right arm would just immediately start hurting. But yeah, other than that, I didn't really get a fever. Or I didn't really have any of the really terrible symptoms people talk about. I just, you know, vibed with an arm that hurted occasionally. And I'm already planning on getting the second shot to complete the cycle and get me fully immunized. And I am so ready. <laughs> I am so ready for like me to get this vaccine and for this to kind of uh, blow over. There, there are people I really want to see. And for that, I, I need to do this. So serious talk over. <laughs> there was also, if I'm thinking back to recent events. Oh, yeah. So I talked about this a little bit earlier. I'm not streaming on April 1st, and it kind of bums me out. Because honestly, I did have a good idea for a stream like late Monday. I had a good idea for something I wanted to do. No, 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 you don't need to apologize. I'm joking, but I'm joking, homie. <laughs> no, 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 you don't need to. No, no, no. So tomorrow, no stream because um, Master had a really good idea for something to do after work, and I really couldn't say no. Yeah, it is the MGP uh, who slept for, I think, less than an hour and then came back to stream. Yeah, I think you slept for a whopping few minutes and then came back. A nice fight you're having there. Um, I'm going to steal all the resources you need while you're doing that. You passed out, yeah. The thing is, I've yelled at MGP to take care of himself so often that at this point I'm just like... Why bother? Because <laughs> I can yell and threaten him with bonking as much as I can. But it only does so much. Okay, we just need one more piano wire and then we are Gucci here. Pretty much exactly. Basic stuff. Okay, so all I need now is one more leather. Are there any more chickens around here? I need to teleport as well. I sent the script. Oh my God, Shep. Holy shit. Can I even read? 
No, my boomer eyes cannot read this. Hold on, I will get my glasses. Hold on. Hold on, my boomer eyes cannot... <laughs> it's just, I'm sorry, written over and over again. Click it, I can't. Um, all tabbing off of this would uh, go back to my desktop. It, Cause it's an online game, it doesn't pause. Okay, let me actually, I, I should have my glasses on while I'm gaming. Uh, because a new area has been restricted. Like my I, I've talked about this before. I have glasses that I wear because my vision is absolute garbo. Nice. This might be enough. Let's get moving. Like, but only for when I'm using my computer. Sorry, I had to think of the wording there for a second. Uh, only when I use my computer, my vision just turns completely garbo after a while. So that's when I should be wearing my glasses. But I always forget <laughs> because, you know, I'm I'm so in the mode when I actually start streaming that I don't think like, hey, this uh, thing that you should be doing, go do it. I'm so in the mindset of like, you know, Make sure everything's working. Make sure everything's on. Do this. Do the thing. Aren't you mainly studying English subjects? No. Uh, history. A survivor has been eliminated. History is my main subject. Yeah, close enough. Core studies, basically. It's uh, it's English with a lot of a lot of extras. That there's there's a lot more to history and like philosophy of history that I don't want to get into because it's going to be a long conversation. Okay, I need to get paper from somewhere else. So let's head to hospital. I should be able to get paper there. So Ace and yeah, English adject. It's basically you're going to need a good knowledge of English to do history, but you it's not it's not English. All right, let us make sniper rifle. Take 50, best one. Oh. Okay, hopefully in one of the other places I have to go. A survivor has been eliminated. A survivor has been eliminated. Oh my f Jesus. Basic stuff. Yeah, but with the glasses, like, it only really affects me when I'm doing um, lectures or any task I'm not 100% paying attention to. Uh, what should I make food-wise? My recommendation is whatever's in your fridge. I'll keep this in mind. I wish I could listen to music for some tasks because, goddamn, is it hard to pay attention sometimes? You've seen Ivan when I... You'll see, Ivan, when hold a rifle like me, it turns out a wonderful product. Even though this is spread of shotgun. Look at my sniper rifle. Question, what if your fridge is empty? Uh, then there is DoorDash. <laughs> For me, at least, there is DoorDash. Uh, no... Usually what will happen at that point when my fridge is empty is I luckily live close to a couple like takeout places where I'll just go saunter my ass over there and go grab something. Oh, beast. A survivor has Question, been what if you live in the bush and can't get deliveries? F. Eliminating survivors. A survivor has been eliminated. Well, the surveillance camera's gone. Has been eliminated. Let's see if the owner comes Someone back. Consecutively eliminating survivors. Question F. F is a term used as a reference to the game Call of Duty. Um, one of the Call of Duty games that I can't remember offhand because I haven't played one since I played Civil War a while back. Oh, shut up. <laughs> 
See, you don't realize how much I can go into diatribes, but I have to do it for a major. <laughs> I do it for my degree of going into too much detail about a topic. I can have a fun time with that. Hey, Socrates, it's a fucking meme. <laughs> No, but like, honestly, you can't describe shit like that in history courses. You can't just describe like, this person was a general. You, you can't do that. A survivor has been you survived. have to go into this full explanation like, so-and-so was born in the middle of bumfuck Indiana. <laughs> to a mother of so and a father of so. He fought in these wars. Between this time and this time, he was a blank general by this time. Like, you can't just go, dude's a general. You have to go into their full, like, life history. So I am so used to, like, especially for assignments, having to go into a stupid amount of detail that it doesn't phase me anymore. Oh my god, I need batteries as well. SMH. I can probably make a moral theory about how fucking F for respect thing is a new moral principle. It probably could be argued, actually. Oh my god, I need batteries badly. Um, I'm probably gonna have to go to Doc for that. Please tell me Doc is open. Doc is open, okay. So let's go to school and get the things we need here. Dun, dun, dun. Honestly, the thing is, you can go into over explanations of pretty much anything. Of course, there's firearms in schools. If this is suddenly United, I mean, I can't make that joke. <laughs> this looks old. I can't make that joke. <laughs> A survivor has been eliminated. Someone is dominating Lumia Island. It's hard not to make that. Learning is near. It's just such a like only here would that be a thing that happens. Kinda situation. You see sunlight? Okay, let's hope I can get the hell out of Alley in Avenue in time. Because I need to at least head down to Dock to get the battery. I also really need... Okay, no, no, no. It's on the side of this building, Sally. It's on the side of the building. I don't want to use this very often. Shut up, Bernice. You'll use it as often as I tell you to. You were allowed to go to bed a long ass time ago, MGP. You do not need to ask me for permission. It is late as shit and pretty much all of my friends from like your general area are already asleep. Even Zero Chi and Zero Chi is the insomniac friend. Like, Zero Chi will just message me at hours, and, like, I'll just start chatting with her, and then I'll realize, like, oh, shit, it's four. <laughs> and I'll be like, yo, it's four. Why aren't you asleep? And she's like, oh, I didn't realize. <laughs> it's just, god damn it. Okay, cool. Insufficient inventory space. Uh, I don't need the bottle. Zero Chi's the night gang. Hell yeah. This looks old. Okay, tactical ops helmet. That's why I try not to talk about people, talk to people when it's nighttime. Oh, is paper just not an option? Ah. Ooh, how much time do I have on my timer? I have 30 seconds. Can I make a risky move to go into chapel and try and explore chapel? Because I need paper to finish, like... What do I need for this? Oh, I need leather for that. Uh, chicken. Give leather. God damn you. Okay. You better. I'll be watching. 
I hope you do get some good food, Shep. Okay, let's see. Can I see if there's paper in, like, these few? Yes! Oh my god, the bet paid off! The bet paid off, boys. Okay. We have severely screwed ourselves if we're in an area we're not supposed to be in. But... The bet worked. <gasps> okay. Okay. Vaguely like the Cape of Good Hope. Okay. A new area has been restricted. Okay, so where are we gonna get shoehorned into? Probably beach. You better have leather for what I did. Thank you. Okay. We're good on everything now. Honestly, I am the person who, like, knows if I rest my head on a pillow, I'm going to want to sleep, but does it anyway. Yeah, I, I know if I put a pillow down and put my head on it, I'm probably going to try and sleep. But then at the same time, I'm also the person who's like, I'm going to do this because I need to relax a bit. It never, it never just ends up relaxing. It always ends with me like taking a sneaky like 10 minute. Oh, hey, bub. Oh, my God. Someone is consecutively eliminating survivors. What? <laughs> final survivors remaining. I threw everything at her. Oh yeah, Bernice has been fucking That was full build. Uh yeah, I I, I think uh Bernice has been nerfed uh from the last time I played them. From what I saw, Jesus Christ. Hmm. I will bury you in the softest pillow ever. Yeah, just bury MGP in pillows. Just put them at his chair. It is probably your best bet to get MGP to actually sleep. I thought I was the one who that didn't sleep. I have been replaced. Yep. M MGP is now the one who never sleeps, Shep. F. Okay, that failed. Let's try again. Let's try again. There we go. Yeah, Bernice has been nerfed. It is clear to see. I'm half tempted to see what MGP typed out. <laughs> Yep, I love it. I, I also love how you went from like a completely normal like YouTuber apology to like 15th century. That's nice. Oh, Darkfire, you're talking about sleep one. Wait till I tell you about sleep two. <laughs> I'm sorry. I know you had caps lock on and hit like... <laughs> I know what happened there, but hell, that was funny. Oh, sleep two is what I need tonight. For fuck's sake. Sleep three is coming this summer, boys. I'm ready. <laughs> Yo, no, dude. Next year, next year down the timeline, the uh, the sleep uh, extent expanded universe, dude. Dude, sleep for the return of sleep? Man. <laughs> In the sleep cinematic universe. Come on. 
Do the ting. Okay, yeah. Okay, don't no, you point. Sleep seven rated M. <laughs> The experiment will now begin. Oh shit. This won't be rubbish, right? Hmm. Tell us so um Master uh sent me a food order <laughs> where he's like, Do you want to join in on this? And I was like during that loading, I'm like, these loading screens usually take forever. I can probably sneak in a cheeky order and have time. That was not the case. I surely can use these branches for something. Okay. I, ca I can't focus on the order until I need to take a nap. Sleep in the sequel. Oh, that's getting posted on Twitter tomorrow. The sleep cinematic universe. You thought Infinity War was a great crossover. <laughs> Zack Snyder's directing it, so it has to be good. <laughs> oh my god, I haven't seen the uh, Zack Snyder cut. But, like, hearing people talk about it makes me semi-interested in looking into it. At the same time, like... I've also watched every other Zack Snyder film, and it has me convinced that I probably will not enjoy this one. Like, I've, I've watched the other films in, like, the DC Cinematic Universe or whatever the hell they're calling it now. And, like... They're okay? I, I don't think this is a controversial opinion. They're okay. <laughs> it, it's, it's not a film franchise where I'm like, oh my god, the new DC film has come out. I need to go now. They're changing all the actors and not all the films are as good as all the others. Yeah, it's super inconsistent. Like, Wonder Woman was an amazing movie. Uh, hold on one second. Sorry. <laughs> My sister came in and she's like, why aren't you ordering faster? And I'm like, I'm fucking trying. I really am. MGP is not going to sleep, Darkfire. This is a fate I already know. Oh, wait, wait, wait. No, I don't. I don't want one of those things. Hold on, hold on, hold on. No. There we go. Okay, order's been made. Order's been made. I, I'm getting food. A survivor has been eliminated. And not just... <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm well aware of your... Because if you remember back, MGP, when we first... Like, when you first came to my streams at, like, the oddest of hours, I would immediately inundate you with go the hell to sleep. And you would immediately respond with no. <laughs> so there's just a point where you tell someone to do something for themselves and they just don't do it where you're like, finally, like, OK, fine. No sleep. I know you're able to like function. Somehow. I don't know how you do it. Bro, I rather watch streams instead of I sleep. I know what you meant. Watch the VOD. I mean, yeah, but at the same time, your body, <laughs> you know, should be taking care of that thing. And I've also been, okay, this is kind of a known part of the lore of my YouTube is just super cursed and like random shit will be like sent upon my YouTube because YouTube doesn't know what to recommend me. A survivor has been eliminated. Uh, no, don't eat the pizza. No, no. 
That is not necessary. Take a potato chip on the other hand. <laughs> <laughs> Shit, what was I on about? Uh Oh, state of my YouTube. Basically, right now, um YouTube has decided that I am a very unhealthy person and has decided to recommend me this one like doctor's videos. Okay, I was going to die there. Okay, now I can finish my order. Awesome. It was a perfect there we go. Food has been ordered. I literally needed to do like three things. A survivor has been eliminated. I went shopping for the entire week today. No joke. Literally, that is what I do every time I go to the shop. When I like go to a grocery store, my entire goal is I'm going to buy food that's going to last me all week. So I'll just buy like a ton of things and cook it in bulk so that it's my meal for the week. I have eaten my hands. Congratulations. How are your, uh, how's the stub typing going? How, how is it like typing with, uh, little stubs? Also, I could also go with the old classic, uh, Carl, that kills people. I have a face. Thank you. So you're just slamming your like, nose into the keyboard. Ah. I guess there will be a lol five as well. Yep, apparently. In the lol cinematic universe. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> Sorry, family. Yeah, when we meet, you were like, wonder what I'm doing up at 3 a.m. till 6 a.m. till stream end. And now I kind of miss it when everyone goes. I, I, I subtly tell you to go to sleep like, man, it's really late for you. <sighs> Crossover with the sleep film. In a world where laughter infects people's sleep. One man, <laughs> only one man can save sleep for everyone. Bruce Willis. <laughs> Why did we sink and say the same thing? What did we say at the same time? <laughs> Do we both think, oh, one man? Because <laughs> that's like in every movie trailer, especially for like action films, where it's like one man against the world. When a meteorite comes down to Earth, <laughs> one man can stop this meteorite. And the, I, I, I just want one time for that to pan over to this one dude going like, what the fuck am I supposed to do? <laughs> I'm not trained in this shit. We have several scientists who could probably figure this out better than I could. Why does that... F why... Mm. <laughs> why do I believe Shep added another curse to our chat? SMH. One man. One McGriddle. One Toyota Corolla that he drives through the drive through and is covered in fast food wrappers. And no time left. Must race to the NASA <laughs> Space Center in Houston, Texas. <laughs> yeah, I go to bed. Jesus Christ, let me take you to my phone. Okay. Coming... Oh, great. I have to figure out if you meant international date or U.S. date. Shit. Coming December 9th of 07. <laughs> if you're typing in U.S. date. International, it's 
The experiment will now begin. The 12th of September, I believe, of 07. People used to visit the island too. It's a pick your own adventure date. It'll premiere on both days. Yeah, time to go back in time and watch this movie. Do you ever feel like when you watch an old film like Oh God, how must this have been like in theaters when it first came out with no preconceived notions? I think you uh, cooked them wrong then, Shep. Uh, I don't believe they're supposed to smell like that. Yeah, because um, before we were at kind of a lull period in the lockdown in my area and they reopened movie theaters in a pretty creative way. Basically, they allowed you to rent out the theater with as many people as you pleased. But you had to buy out the whole theater at like $90. So me and like 11 of my buddies are all like, look, if we all go and socially distance, like we can pay $9 to go watch a movie, which is super cheap in the US. So we decided, we looked through all the film choices and there was of course the ones that were like premiering recently and all that good stuff. But there was also the choice of Gremlins, which is this like very cheesy, like horror comedy film. And my brain went, okay, I have the option of either watching the Jurassic World movie or Gremlins. You can probably guess which one I picked. <laughs> I picked Gremlins. Jurassic Gremlins, no. Okay, so I need to head to Pond next. No, I don't think Sonic was an option or else I would have had these friends see the Sonic movie as well. A survivor has been eliminated. I have seen it. I'm actually not upset by the Sonic movie. It was pretty good. That can go away. I won't spoil it then. Uh, I will say me and my friends have an inside joke now of a um, gift that we would send each other. Is it done? You went to the ice cream man. Yep. Oh my god, what more do I have to crap? Crap, craft, god damn it. There we go. The sea the sheath of Shah Jahan, I barely could pronounce that F. Oh wait, Ice Cream Man. No, did not go to that film. Uh that film terrible. The last film I went to see was the Demon Slayer movie. Oh my god, every... Okay, I'm hoping I level up soon. I do. Okay. Damn it. It wasn't enough time. Uh, no. Oddly enough, this is going to upset Shep again. The last film I saw before lockdown, because I don't go to the movies very often, was Cats 2019. <laughs> that, that was the last movie I saw in theaters. I went to other events and saw other things. Like, I got to see one of my favorite podcasts live, which honestly, if you can go to a podcast you like live tour, I highly recommend <laughs> getting euthanized, please. Joke, joke, joke. I know, I know, I know you mean it as a joke. But, like, as long as I don't make a big deal about it, Twitch probably won't. Uh, but, 
like my goal for watching Cats wasn't I want to go and have a good time with friends. It was I want to go with a group of friends to laugh at this thing I do not comprehend. <laughs> It wasn't a thing where I was like, oh, this will be a fun time. I will have a great time doing this. No, it was basically, yo, you guys need to see this. <laughs> it's like, um, oh God, there was this article that was going around that everyone was like, no, no, you need to read this uh, called like, uh, does Bruno Mars is gay? And it is the funniest fucking thing I've read. But you don't read it because you actually care about the value of the thing. You read it because it is such an oddity. <laughs> I'm sorry, what? The Does Bruno Mars is Gay. It was like an auto-created article. So, like, basically this bot was made to write articles for a clickbait site. And there's no grammatical sense. There's no, like, context of understanding of the English language or that any human being would write this. But it's basically made if somebody random, like, types it in, the question, uh, is Bruno Mars gay? Or accidentally types, does Bruno Mars is gay? They'll come to the article. Um, but, like, you don't read those kind of articles because you care about the information. You read stuff like that to be like, yo, look at this train wreck. <laughs> look at this terrible thing. You need to watch it with me. Oh, God, am I? You know what? I will pull it up. After this game, we will read this article because it, it's seeming like some of you guys don't know the brilliance that is this article. Hold on, I'm going to search it up real quick. It should. Da, 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 da. I don't have Funny Mike. Oh, you want to read it with Funny Mike? No. Oh my god, someone made it into a song. Hold on. Someone made it into a song. That is fucking incredible. Found it! I found it! Hold on, can I do it while playing the game? Hmm. It's a tempting thing. Yeah, it's in song form. When I looked it up, it had lyrics. No, it's not karaoke time. Um, I, even though it's probably from a small creator and they probably don't have a studio that'll be immediately like, there, yeah, ban this man. Like, I don't want to risk it. Will it contain something useful? After this game, I will read this article. People used to visit the island too. Because we, we need something between games. Ban the man. <laughs> oh, God. This is another time when my brain thinks up a meme that nobody else will understand except for myself. Uh... It's it's this meme where it's basically like an image with text, but it has like voiceover in the background and it's this like courtroom and this judge goes like, order, order, bailiff, slap this man's testicles. <laughs> no, no, you can't do this to me. And then it's just someone like with vague slapping noises screaming. And I don't know why, but I find it fucking hysterical. Shep, do you even want to consider like the stupid crap that YouTube recommends me? Because you're going to have to comprehend it if I go into the reasonings as to why that probably showed up into my algorithm. It's because I've been watching, like, Try Not To Laugh videos, so anything vaguely funny has been showing up on my YouTube Recommended. So it's like, Doctor reacts to memes now, or like, Vicar reacts to memes. So yeah, that, that has been the state of my YouTube at the moment. 
Okay, I just need a ribbon and a flower. This won't be rubbish, right? I'm pretty good at this. Well played. How'd you manage that, Shep? How did you break the funny mic? Did you just talk into it? Screaming? I mean, understandable. Oh, hey, buddy. Ow. Let's make sure I go here so that she knows I'm not here to cause problems. Screaming? Hmm, I wonder why that would break a microphone in its capacity to, you know, sense inputs. Hmm. Okay, as long as you don't attack me, I won't do shit to you. Besides, I probably could kill you. If I wanted to. <laughs> I will fuck up your face with... Danger? Why is there a danger circle? And why did I want to stand in there? I mean, don't half of your screams sound like you're, like, vaguely getting murdered? This won't be rubbish, right? A survivor has been eliminated. Nice. I'm glad for that. I'm, no. <laughs> if it broke your mic, it's probably going to break my uh, headphones or speakers. I mean, fair, MGP. I have been in those moods where I try to talk to people through emotes. Because I'm like, I cannot be asked. I think I can use this. To actually type out a response because I am that level of lazy right now. This won't be rubbish, right? The funny thing is I understand it. Which means that someone is consecutively eliminating survivors. <laughs> someone is drinking in my ear. That is not the sound I want to hear. Okay, I just need to find one thing of bottles. Please let there be bottles. These aren't the enemy this time. These are our saviors. This, this is the new form of Egyptian hieroglyphics. Hey, Zaki, you want to um, chase me? I can take you to some friends. A survivor has been eliminated. Hey, buddy, you still here? I brought a friend. Something useful? Are you just going to talk in emotes in my chat this entire time? <gasps> yes, there we go. Let's go. Last box, let's go. Oh, I've gained chain. I can have kunai with chain. A survivor has been eliminated. Someone is consecutive. Is that echoes? Oh my god, I was in Echo Stream uh yesterday. And um I was just kind of shooting like I was just talking to her and just having a good time. And then there was just this moment in the game where uh like she made a decision it was the wrong decision at the time so there was an option for like 400 bits to play the like really sad like dun, 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 to play like that sad that sad tune So I did it at like the perfect time <laughs> and I caught her off guard and she just started dying laughing. Oh yes, thank you, corpse. Yo, that made my build so much faster. A new area 
has been restricted. Okay, cool. As long as it's not the one I'm in. Pretty good at this. Ooh, there's meteor right there. I don't need it. The thing is, I'm broke. I bought like. Whenever I have a friend of mine who's about to debut, what I'll usually do is I'll just bulk buy bits and use like a third of them for the debut and then just save the rest for things I want to do. So like that was one of those situations where I had a bunch of bulk bits that I just was begging for a use for. So yeah, like I did for Cerise's debut. Yeah, pretty much exactly. Because, you know, I really am the kind of person who's like, if you are my friend, I will fucking move mountains for you. If it means that you will have a good time. I, I'm that kind of person where, like, if my friend's doing some sort of creative endeavor or my friend is doing, like, something cool and I can support somehow. I will be the kind of person who's like, okay, it is time for me to become the cheerleader. Oh, shite. Do we not have garlic? I mean, yeah, of course. 100%. What a if you want to do some Hachima streams, I will support that a hundred percent. Honestly, I've thought about doing non-cursed cooking streams, but like it, it, if you're not here, you wouldn't have context to the fact that it's not actually cursed. That it's actually just quite normal. But just the idea of, like, making something simple like a quesadilla and then just basically ramping up the anxiety of, oh, no, what could it be? Okay, I could have sworn there was garlic. No, 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 my friend. This won't be rubbish, right? Cake. Oh, they're... I would do a cake decorating stream if I could actually figure out how the hell to get my entire stream set up into my kitchen. That is literally the only thing stopping me from doing that. Is I would have to figure out how to get that to work. Okay, come on. Oh, wait, wait, wait. That's the thing I need. That's what I needed. Okay. Let's make boiling water. Hot ramen, and then that's going to build into gar into hot garlic ramen. Oh! It would be nice to find a safe. Jesus Christ! What the fuck is Jackie? Someone is dominating Lumia Island. You get your phone and you start streaming. Yep. I mean, I could but the problem is i like having my gaming pc because that's where i encode like everything of the stream is on my pc's like gpu so moving to my laptop which is basically useless <laughs> for most other things there will be a noticeable drop in quality mm. how about we play like one more game and as promised for those of you who stuck around for that game we are going to read a little article oh my god that was fast as hell you have to eat the phone so it's facing down at your cake pretty much you would have to we're, we're gonna read this article while we're queuing and like starting the game because at the start of the game I could take a little time the rumor come out. Does Bruno Mars is gay? This is, by the way, a preview of what the um, cursed fanfic stream is going to be. It's going to be me being way over dramatic about things that are cursed. Oh, God, they put a fucking ad over the thing. You stupid sons of bitches. 
they did it again. Uh, basically, Bruno Mars is gay is the most talked about in the media in the few years ago. Even it has happened in 2012, but some of the public still curious about what is exactly happening and to be the reason there is a rumor comes out about his gay. <gasps> <sighs> At the time, he became a massive social... Oh, I'm sorry. At the time, he became the massive social networking rumor. The public, especially his fans, are shocked. He just came out with his bad rumor, which is spread massively. This time is not about his music career, but his bad rumor. Oh yeah, bring out the popcorn. You're going to need it. The rumor is out of standardized of hoax, according to the last singer... The last reported this singer revealed himself as homosexual. Do you still believe or not? This rumor is really much talked by people, even in the persons of his fans. <laughs> that is the, the Does Bruno Mars is Gay article. <laughs> wow, that couldn't have been timed better to know. <laughs> like right when I actually have to do stuff is when the article ended. <laughs> Shep gone. Wow, my viewers didn't drop out that. I'm shocked, honestly. Uh, <laughs> honestly, it's just the misspellings that kill me. By the way, I am planning... Oh, God, do I... Am I even really going to be playing... I am going to be playing a game next week. But, like, I am planning to do a couple of the streams we redeemed during our subathon next week. And then the week after is basically going to be wrapping them up and finishing them up. This won't be rubbish, right? So a lot of the usual suspect games that you're expecting are probably not going to happen next week. I just claimed a coin. Oh, I'm going to use it for crack. <laughs> Wait, can you customize that message? By the way, you're laughing legit sounds like mine. Well, your hair is also apparently like mine. So, like, I, I think the correct word is, like, doppelganger or, like... <laughs> oh, my God. You can customize that message. That's the default, obviously. <laughs> like, when you go into create a character, you just get long hair butler boy. That would make a lot of sense. Are there any usable stones here? Sure. I, I'm now... You dumbass. <laughs> I how often I use it. There's only you one restricted area right now. How did you get there? Hold on. Let me show you guys how dumb this man is. What is he doing there? There is one restricted area he could have died in. Did he? Did he just want to die? That is the only logical explanation to that action. There we go. Okay, now I can screw off. I just need one more hammer. And then it's time to dip. Why am I imagining heaven as like a Bethesda character creation? Does heaven also, like, crash when you try to remove the, the features? Oh my god, that was cursed during our subathon. I was, like, panicking slightly when that happened, because I'm like, oh god, if this game is a complete and utter, like, buggy, unworking shit show, I haven't come up with a plan for the last four hours. What am I going to do? So it was just me hoping during that last like one that the issue was me editing the facial features. Because if it wasn't, then I don't know what I would have done. You want God to be Todd Howard? Uh, God, what about this thing? It just works. By the way, there should have been a counter. I should have put a counter up during the Fallout 4 stream of how many times I said the phrase, it just works. Oh my God, is there no more hammers? Are we, are we out of hammers? 
Is it no longer hammer time? I've got 4 BG RAM laying around. You want? No, I'm good. Or 4 GB, I'm guessing you meant. No, I'm good. I have 16, which is more than enough for what I really want to do. I'm going to upgrade it again to probably... Like 32 and then 64 when the need is there. But right now, for what I do mainly, like 16 gigs does more than enough. Will it contain something useful? There we go. That's what I needed. Oh, the sound of hammer. I'm pretty good at this. Okay, let's head back up to Av. Because we need to be here. Okay, I still need another branch and I still need leather. There's chicken. Die. Thank you. Yeah, honestly, for me, if I were to upgrade anything at the moment, it would probably be my CPU. Yeah, I can probably get another like 16 gig kit and just strap that on there. And it will do fine. I hope someone eliminates him before I get to him. Okay, so the nearest person's at school over there. And I think... Oh, shit. I need to get to Alley. Yeah, have you seen the price for 32 gigs? It was, like, at about 120. Yeah, honestly, this is one of the best times to buy PC parts, if you ask me. Um, crap. Okay. I can go back here. I just need to get all this stuff I need over here in about two minutes. So let's hope we have good luck with that. Oh, so far we're doing pretty well. Oh, branch, branch. I need branch. Oh, it's so much more convenient to grab branches that way. Okay, I just need a diving suit. Homie, you did all that work. Oh my gosh. Yo, we got the luck strat. Let's go. A survivor has been eliminated. This oh great! I'm so happy that I'm hungry. Uwu is dead, or Owo oh, oh, is dead. Aya, uh, welcome back. For one thing, okay, what have you returned for, Aya? Uh... Uh oh, uh oh. All right, you have to give me a line. It would be nice to find a safe route. <gasps> Uh, <laughs> okay, okay. Honestly, you're a sweet, kind person, and you just have this energy to you that is absolutely infectious, and it just really, you know, and it, it, it just, it brings up spirits. It brings up, like, everyone around, and you can kind of just tell how everyone reacts to just the energy you bring and it is really nice sometimes to have you just to talk to even like it, it means a lot and another another thing like your excitement over things like when you get into a topic you're passionate about the way you talk about it is so utterly interesting and this is not memeing, like this is an actual thing. I love it when people talk to me about their passions because the, l I, I don't know what your face looks like, but I can just imagine the look on your face when you talk about shit that you're passionate about. And it's just in my head, at least this over excited, like childlike wonder of, oh my God, this person wants to talk about the thing I like. Good job, buddy. 
yeah, that is that is what I will say for now. That those are the things when I I think about you that I love. I'm glad you felt that was worth it. I will say this now, though. I, I, I don't think I'm the only one. But, like, do you ever love it when, like, people talk about their passions with you? And, like, you let them go off on it? This is not a place to use Even if you don't, like, fully understand what is happening? Yeah, I, I see so many times, and it just crushes me every time. When someone talks about something they're truly passionate about, be it a hobby, be it a, uh, like, game they're into, be it, like, something that they love. When I see them then, like, shut down afterwards because somebody had told them that it was annoying or that they didn't care, it crushes me because I'm like, no, no, no. I may not know about this topic, but I want you to go into detail because, God, do you just, like, exhume this adorable energy when you talk about this thing, and I love the smile on your face when you talk about it. That that is that is my opinion on the matter. Is like, I I I just love that kind of overjoyous look when people talk about their passions or talk about the thing they're really into at the moment. Oh no, morphine is gone. Long live morphine. I did go on a bit of a tangent about that one, but yeah, it's right. Or even like it's like when it's a crush as well, like when it's somebody you're crushing on, it's like, please, please just keep that smile on your face. Oh, wait, I just realized the person I killed. <laughs> oh, no. While I was going on that whole thing with Aya and being like, super honest about the things that like uh, like about her i was hitting a man whose name is dick's enormous <laughs> i'm sorry Aya. <laughs> yeah rip him rip that man everyone gathers here it'll be troublesome Oh god, I'm gonna find this clip later. <laughs> and then it's gonna be this real. <laughs> oh, <laughs> I just realized that. <laughs> oh no, I, I could have picked any other time to have taken that encounter. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> now I'm gonna look back at this really like heartfelt, like honest to god truth about I and I'm just gonna see me like slashing away at a dude whose name is Dix Enormous. Only traces of civilization remain. Oh I'm not gonna live that down. Guaranteed. Okay, let's just for fun. Hey buddy, where'd you go? Oh there you are. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. I've got an idea. Let's leave. <laughs> let's, let's go. Okay. Let's combine these two. They might be passionate about that as well. No, I, I don't think. All clipped. I... I I got her uh, money's worth on that redeem. I thought there would be people here. I was left with no choice. Okay, meat, good. I can make I can make tendies. Yeah, Keck W on that one. <laughs> oh my god. I I need to get like a lol or a Keck emote. I think I'm going to replace one thing on the list with that. Nice, okay. You have a diving suit, which I don't know why you need as a dog, but you know what? Oh, oh, they're fighting. I'm gonna come in. 
because it seems like they're finished. So, yep. Okay, they're at the teleporter. I thought there would be people here. Damn it, I missed them. Okay. Let's see if they're somewhere around here. I have it in 4K. Nice. This is a real tendies moment. Man, I'm caught slipping in 4K Ultra HD. SMH. I need to monitor the movements of my enemies. Oh, great. There's a Wicklin, which I'm not messing with at the moment. Okay, I need your meat. Wait. <laughs> God damn it, not again. <laughs> God damn it. I can pop a chalky milk. Let's go. Chalky milk make the pain go away. Actually, wait. Honey was here as well. So let's let's get rid of some of my bread. Bring in the honey. And oh fuck. Okay. Oh damn it, I'm dead! No! I was distracted! No! Oh, I was out of SP. Fuck. No. No. Okay, that's that's how it ends today, I guess. That is how it ends today, I guess. Okay, we've been streaming for about three hours and I just got dinner, so I kind of want to go and eat that real quick while it's still warm. Yeah, we ended the last ERBS stream on a W. So, you know what? I will take that as a victory that we even got that moment. But, yeah. Uh, that, that was... <laughs> that was a... Bleh. Okay, let's see who's on. I think someone I know is on, but I need to make sure that they're still on. Because we'll either raid into them or I'm going to pick somebody else. Oh yeah, they could use it. So we are going to raid a buddy of mine here in Enigma Lazuli. They, we've been talking a bit more and it, I've become good friends with this person. They are really just fun to talk to and I have a really good time talking to them. So for anyone who may or may not be new, here is my Twitter, where you will get the most accurate stream updates, my Discord, where you can chat with me, or you'll get better stream updates than both Twitter or <laughs> Twitch, for that matter. And we also are going to hit Enigma with the Butler Raid. The butler raid is going to look like this on the other side. If you are somehow one of the unlucky fellows who did not get a sub last time uh, during the subathon, I made it pretty cheap so you can grab it. I had a really fun time tonight playing this game, even though our first game kind of crashed and burned and failed. Um, I'm still glad that we got to play this one. So thank you guys for coming today. Thank you so very much for sticking around if you were part of Aya's raid at the very beginning of this. Also, Aya, thank you for the five gifted subs. Uh, the Plankers, thank you for the 45 bits. And from before, let's quickly go through this. Lilith of Navy, Tuber, the Spicy Boy 345, and Kai Tan, thank you for the follows. Goodbye, everybody. I love you guys. Goodbye.